Can a data analyst become a business analyst? Short answer, yes. I'll look at why and how a data analyst can become a business analyst. We'll talk about skills, training, and whether this is actually a common transition to make. Hi, I'm Jen. I help people build analytics skills and careers with videos on this channel every week. Check out the description for analytics resources. If you've seen my video about business analysts versus data analysts, you already know some of the differences between the roles, but you also know that there's a lot of similarities between these two jobs. Business analysts analyze problems, organizations, and processes through a business lens. As part of this, they use analytics in their job, but analytics isn't their primary focus. Business analysts use data and analytics to help support business decisions and changes. I think the best implemented data analyst roles share the same feature. While data analysts go deeper and more technical in the data, at the end of it, they're still supporting something that needs to happen, possibly change within the business. They're not doing analysis just for the sake of analysis. If that sounds like your current data analyst role, then congratulations, this is going to be a very simple change for you. You can already point to the work you're doing as tying in heavily to what you'd be doing in a business analyst position that you might be applying for. Let's look a little more at what it means to move into a business analyst role if you're coming from a more isolated technical data analyst position though. Most data analysts will have more technical skills, knowledge of a programming language or an analytics tool like Tableau or Power BI than the typical business analyst. That's not to say that business analysts can't benefit from or even are, aren't required to use these tools sometimes depending on the role. Every company implements these roles a little bit differently. So some business analyst roles will require you to have language of some of these visualization and no code analytics tools. It will be more typical that you would see a requirement for Tableau or Power BI than that you would see a requirement for a programming language in a business analyst role. Assuming that you have this technical background as a data analyst, one of the easiest ways to transition into a business analyst role would be to look for these business analyst roles that do lean a little more technical. That's where the skills that you have, the knowledge you have as a data analyst, are really going to put you a step above some of the other candidates and really play to your favor when you're applying and interviewing for the job. Because business analysts tend to be so tied into the business, communication and leadership skills tend to be more essential than they are for data analysts. Again, we're speaking generally here and there are advantages to strong communication and leadership skills for a data analyst. These will really help you out in the role. For most people working in a data analyst role though, they're not going to have as much time spent on influencing other people, especially in other roles in the organization. Building up this skill will really help you as you switch into a business analyst position. Business analysts also need at least a basic level of project management skills. We're not talking full on project manager or PMP certification here, but you are going to typically be involved in projects and in smaller organizations, you may be wholly responsible for leading those projects. So knowing how to run a project effectively can be really useful. If this isn't something you're familiar with, check out my two favorite tools for project management for analytics. It's certainly not uncommon to see data analysts become business analysts. There's so much overlap in these roles that there are often strengths for people in each role that may want to transition back and forth. I've previously talked about business analysts becoming data analysts, which requires slightly different skill set. But again, we have all of this overlap here. If you are considering making the switch between a data analyst and a business analyst role, Focus on the skills that you're lacking and look for opportunities to improve these. For you, it might mean training or it could just mean more on the job application, looking for chances to coordinate more with others in the business, to influence or take the lead on other projects. Or it could mean getting deeper into project management and organization skills that you'll find helpful. I'll link to a video that I did recently talking about my two favorite analytics project management tools that you may find interesting to learn. Thanks so much for watching. I hope to see you next week.